Mm. What are you thankful for in the year of miracles? <laughs> the kingdom. The kingdom, my family. Family. And God's family. Faith and family. Uh, I'm thankful for God creating a safe place here in the City of Angels Church. I felt like this is my first time ever coming to a church and I'm just super blessed to experience all the things that I'm experiencing. Just talking to people and getting out of my show and like smiling and laughing and God, gosh, he's teaching me so much. I'm grateful for the Metro Coast um, to see how many souls have come into the kingdom. Um, we, I mean, in the Southland from 75 to 129 disciples and then in the West from 56 to 86 disciples. So it's been awesome to see over 400 and oh, over 400 baptisms. We had a goal of 300. So God is moving in an incredible way. I'm super grateful to see all that God is doing and for us to do even greater things. Yeah, like yeah. Born, yeah. Yeah. Man, something I'm thankful for is the church and getting baptized this year. This year, I got baptized in February. Yeah. All the year of miracles have been so amazing for me. Faith building for sure, and I can't wait to see what's going I do too. Wow, what am I thankful for? I'm thankful for my relationship with God and also my incredible fiance. In the year of miracles, I am super grateful that God has given me the ability to have grace through hardship and through all of that. I can just be grateful for Him. I'm thankful for LMU, uh, the cross. To be closer than God than I have ever been my whole life. I had so many limits in my mind coming into this year about what God could do, and he shattered all of them. I'm so thankful for the kingdom, for the truth, for all my sisters and brothers in the faith, all the leaders of the church, my daughters, just to be an inspiration. I'm thankful for going to Ignite this year, doing your work home. very nice and crazy experience, and got to learn a lot from that. I'm thankful for my brother getting baptized this year. Um, it made me so proud of him. I'm grateful for to my brothers and sisters around me right now. I'm grateful for my disciple, uh, Femi, shout out. Um, I'm grateful for God, really. I'm grateful for everything he's done. The Year of Miracles has been so amazing. I have today got to watch my best friend from 10 years ago be restored into God. And so I cannot believe that these things are so happening right before our eyes. I can't wait to see what next year brings us. And we're grateful for the International Christian Church Marriage Ministry. What I have been most thankful for in 2023 is family, particularly my four kids and my husband, and the fact that we got to celebrate 29 years of marriage on November 5th. And I'm also very thankful for my spiritual family. I am so happy to be alive at this time. What are you thankful for? Uh, uh, Christmas. Christmas! And I'm thankful for God never giving up on me. I'm thankful first and foremost for God coming into my life and uh, the family he's allowed me to have and uh, three kids, uh, a daughter-in-law, a son-in-law, a granddaughter who's seven months old and just the uniqueness and uh, individuality that each of them bring. Um, I'm very grateful for my family. Love you all. Metro Coast, we love you guys. Uh, we're so grateful for every single disciple in the Metro Coast. You guys are incredible. So grateful for our partnership and the love of God that we share together. Yes, each and every one of you are miracles in our lives and we've cherished every single memory. We love you guys. Amen. On to the year of blessings. Woo! Love you so much, guys. Ja, what are you thankful for in the year of miracles? Uh, I came late in the year of miracles. So, wait, what, what are you thankful yeah. for? <laughs> you know what, what I'm thankful for in the year of miracles? Yeah. I'm thankful for God just really uh, reaching out into me to save me from the darkness. I was a heathen, always plotting and scheming, wrestling with these demons, the streets to leave you fainting. Looking for love.